Hi there, this is Dave, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So in the last episode, yeah, we just traveled around, didn't do too much, but um, but yeah, I, w I was stuck here. There's this, um, there's this gem that we need to go get to activate the shrine, and uh, I ran out of these, but I've just found some up here. So this is awesome. So I'm going to, uh, I'm going to uh, throw these... Oh, okay. Uh, that's awesome. Uh, and hopefully we can uh, we can get um, we can get this done. We can get this uh, gem out of here. I don't know what happened to the last one. Maybe if I would have step stepped on it. Oops. <laughs> Should have glided. Maybe stepping on it would have been a an idea. Uh, I, but I don't know if I can. Um, I wish there was some sort of boards or something that I could use, but uh, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna start off with this, and then um, yeah, I'm, I'm I think so. I looked at the map again, and I think there should be a um, uh, one of those um, geoglyphs nearby. So hopefully I can figure out where that is, um, and hopefully it's the right one. So I'm gonna attach this like this again. Maybe I can step, wait, step, maybe I can step on this? Doesn't look like it. There's gotta be a way. That would be fun. Because yeah, if I, if I had a board or something, oh, oh, it's not, it's a bit slippery. But even if I could get it out of here, you know. If it wouldn't teleport back in here, then we would be fine. But uh, it doesn't look like it's going to allow me to stand on this. Hmm, wait a minute. Thinking, thinking. Oops, oops. Let's, uh, how about we uh, hatch that as well? Step on this. <laughs> Come on. This is this is this is crazy. Oh, how about okay, maybe if I get a second one. Even closer. If I get a second one and attach it like here. Maybe I could like somehow just lodge myself inside. Okay, there we go. Let's try this. Oh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, no, 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 don't fall down. Don't, oh my goodness. I think we got it. I'm just going to move it like this for now because uh, I don't want it to... Uh, fall in the hole, but that's probably what happened. It probably just rolled back into the hole. Here you go. You who offers the crystal, I will grant you a light that banishes evil. Is this different or is this still just a blessing? Okay, let's go. Alright, so yeah, it's just a blessing unless there's something right here. A big battery. Oh, so that means I get more, m more uh, battery? I, maybe, maybe that's what they mean. I don't know. I can't really see my belt. I'll check after. Yeah, we still get a blessing, so that's good. Hmm. 
Okay, so now that I've done that, where's my power belt? Now I just see, still see the one cell on there. So there's got to be something to do with that battery. Let me see what that says here. If I check out the battery... Is it here somewhere? Because I don't think I've gotten one of those before. So if it's not here... Oh! Big battery. I have no idea. Okay, um, so yeah, so I guess my idea would be to go back to a shrine. What is that? Wow. So much cool stuff. Not a shrine, but a, a tower. So let, and then glide down um, to down this way, because I think there should be another geoglyph around here, or it could be around here or something. Now, I'm not sure if that's the one I need to find, but I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to travel here and then go south. Okay, so south is this way. So let's just, uh, oh, well, yeah, I guess we can't glide for too, too long because of our, uh, our stamina. Oh, but I can use some gust of wind to get as far as I can. This must be the, oh, wait, is this just a village? Uh, yeah, we're just at Rito Village could do that quest where there's a bird perched or something <laughs> but yeah no I guess this wasn't a good idea uh, we can't get too far so I'm gonna have to let go here and, um, yeah there's a uh, perch oh boy oh, oh, oh no I thought I could cl climb on that man hey what oh I couldn't take up my glider again all right, that's fine. <laughs> let's let's go back to where we were. All right, so let's go south now. <laughs> um. All right, so yeah, I think I'll leave my horse. I'm not sure though. Let me let me let me see how the ter what the terrain looks like. I might be able to. So let's go. What I want to do though, maybe I want to. Uh, fuse. Oops. Come on. I want to fuse uh, a rock with this claymore. So that I'll use that for a uh, heavy weapon. Alright, where are you? Come on. You got this. Do, do, I have to put, do I have to attach a rocket to you? Alright, let's see if we can... Uh, traverse this uh, terrain here. It's kind of neat. There's like just a random trees over there. But it's also nice that we can... What? Oh, jeez, that almost fell on top of me. Yeah. It's nice that we can ride our horse over here and we're going to hit the trail again soon. But is this the way? Yeah, it's kind of south. Okay, do I want to go this way? Let's stop for a second. Do I want to go... Yeah, it, this seems kind of more dangerous. Maybe... I know this is a canyon, though. Oh, yeah, no, I wanted to go from here. That's what I want to do. Even though it's not going to be this area, it's going to be here. Hmm. Where sh so maybe I should teleport... Yeah, I'll teleport here and then I'll um I'll go I'll go down. I mean, or I could just I could just ride my horse. Yeah, I'm I'm just going to chill, ride my horse. And if I see anything along interesting along the way, 
I'll let you guys know. Like this guy! <laughs> uh, wait. Is it this way? Yeah. Alright, cool. See you guys later! Yeah. Ooh. You must also be searching for pieces of Misko's treasure. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't know? There once was a legendary bandit by the name of Misko, but thievery isn't what made them a legend. It was their unparalleled fashion sense. It said that Misko collected rare outfits from all over the world and hid their pieces throughout Hyrule. It may only be a story, but who could resist a call of garments like that? For fashion lovers like me, Misko's treasure is the ultimate score. That's why we're out in force trying to find it. So fate and fashion must have brought the two of us together right here. Shall I tell you where the pieces of Misko's treasure are said to be hidden? Yes. I thought that might strike your fashionable fancy. Now do you have a map? Yes, write it down on my map, please. Uh... Here's what I've heard. Huh. A piece of a fairly wild outfit from Misko's collection said to fill the wearer with power is around here. Oh, a piece from a quite stylish outfit from Misko's collection said to let you quickly climb cliffs might be here. A piece from a very snappy outfit from Misko's collection said to keep you safe in lightning is around here. <laughs> all of those, all these details come from my various fashion forward friends who travel in other regions, but I'm not sure any of these treasures are quite right for me, given I don't like to battle and I don't climb cliffs. If you're attempting a difficult journey, I'm sure those styles could come in handy. That reminds me, do you know about the great fairies? Yep, I do. But you're going to tell me anyway. Um, Woodland Stable in Elden recently. Wonder what that's about. Oh, I'm looking for Elden. Where is that? All right, cool. Well, that that's very cool. I'm glad we took this trail and not just warped. Um, that's that's amazing. So, uh, oh, there's some peppers along the way here. I'm just gonna grab these, but uh, but oh, that's gonna be so cool. We get to find some treasure, some gear. Um, I don't know if it's obtainable yet, but um, I might go check, try to find one. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see, but uh, yeah, I'll let you know if I see anything else along the way. Okay, so I'm at Tabantha Bridge Stable. Um, I think I'm supposed to gather some info for the Gazette? I'm not sure though. Good heavens, you're soaking wet <laughs> while well, the rain just started. Well, welcome to Tabantha Bridge Stable. Come and dry oh. yourself off. Traveling, are we? Um... Okay, gets rugged. Yes, we know. Someone crossed Bantha Great Bridge saying, I want to bring music and food to Rito Village. Hmm. Okay, hope he's okay. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, I don't know. Nothing out of the ordinary. Good evening. Welcome to Timothy Bridge Stable. You know, you're giving off kind of a swordsman vow. Vibe. Oh, because you are one, I see. Whoa, a real life swordsman! Uh, sorry, I said that too loud. Oh, I mean, uh, I'm sorry, I got a little too excited there. My name's Kenyo. I want to be a swordsman someday, I'm, so I'm doing all this work to bulk up. Nice to meet ya. I'm gonna be so buff someday that I won't even need a tow towing harness to carry lumber and stuff. Yeah, we know what a towing harness. Alright, yeah. I haven't built one yet, but... Oh, here he is. This is who we need to talk to. I smell a story. Hmm, hardly a trace of a recipe remains. Just the remnants of half-eaten Hylian pine cones. Hey, partner, you're looking good. Were you also pulled to this place by the inescapable tug of a story? I'm chasing some new chirps and warbles from my beloved little birds. A group of goats is a herd, or a trip, or a tribe. Anyway, this stable has been raising a small herd of white goats. Or it was until all these white goats up and vanished all of a sudden. Mm. That's not where it stops, though. Some have said that Princess Zelda may also be involved. Anyway, why don't you talk with 
Chork, the guy who was taking care of the white goats. I'll look for more clues. Partner, time for you to get to work. There's a big scoop here. I can feel it. Yeah. Why'd they run away? Hey, buddy, have you seen some white goats around here? I'd given those goats all the love and care in the world, but the other day they ran off together. They didn't even finish all their food before they left. The Hylian pine cones weren't eaten. I followed Princess Zelda's recipe perfectly, but it could have been the feed that drove them off. Yeah, Princess Zelda shared the recipe when she visited the stable a while back. It's really amazing how much she knows about animals. I never would have expected her to be developing healthy food feed recipes. In this case, it's a recipe for a special kind of feed for white goats. The main ingredient is fresh Hylian pine cones. It's actually pretty unusual. It requires you to mix the pine cones in whole. You don't grind them down or anything. I didn't want my wonderful white goats to eat the reci recipe the princess gave me, so I put in a glass bottle, but a big storm came through one day and it blew the bottle off somewhere. Wasn't able to find it after that, so I've been making the recipe from memory since then. But what would make my white goats spit up the Hylian pine cones and run off like that? Did they, did they really hate Princess Zelda's recipe that much? Ah, okay. So yeah, so some pine cones. I saw one out here, and I wonder if you just gotta follow them. Like, yeah, look at that! I'm gonna follow the trail of pine cones, see where it leads me. Are those your white goats? <laughs> oh no, did they go off the cliff? No, no, the trail goes this way. This is so neat. So sidetracked, like I wanted to go talk to people inside the, t the stable, but here we are. Uh, but now that I activated, I think I can warp back. But are we gonna have to like herd them back here? I, I can't I can hardly see with the rain no that's a fox hmm. I wonder if they like fell down a hole or something this is so funny where are they how many pine cones did they have with them? There they are! So what am I supposed to do? Am I sp Oh, I'm supposed to ride them maybe? Oh, there's a bottle. Unless they follow the bottle, I don't know. Um, let me see. Oh yeah, they're, they're standing still. Whoa, those are my white goats! So this is where they ran off to. Okay, that's simple. <laughs> there, there, I'm just glad to see you. Are you all okay? And you're the one who found them? Thank you, I won't forget this. This bottle, this is what I was using to keep Princess Zelda's recipe safe. Let me see it. I need to check the recipe. Mm, yes, yes. Wait, oh no! Grind the pine cones into a powder. I'm not supposed to use the Hylian pine cone hole? I should have known something was off. I did look really hard to eat. <laughs> My poor sweet goats. They must have run off because of the awful food I was making them eat. I'm so sorry. I hurt you all when I thought I was helping. It was my fault all along. I would have I would have run away too. Can't believe I doubted the recipe that Princess Zelda shared with me. Should have noticed my mistake right away. After all, I really do want to take the best possible care of the goats. But it's not just about what kind of food you feed them, right? It's important to show them you care with all your heart. I swear that from now on, I will take care of you all with the same kindness and compassion that Princess Zelda displays. That's the best way to show my gratitude for her sharing the recipe with me. Oh, and I really, really can't thank you enough for finding my white goats and the recipe. We're going to head back to the stable. You take care. Hey, partner. I saw everything, partner. A perfect investigation with a happy ending. I expect nothing less from you. Hmm, do you think it's coincidence that the missing white goats and the lost recipe were in the same place? I have another theory. Maybe the white goats set out to find the bottle themselves because they couldn't stand to eat the wrong recipe anymore. I don't think that's the case, but it does make you wonder, doesn't it? Oh, that's right. This was your first job, wasn't it? 
Partner, you did quite well to get such results for your first time out. Why, I'm feeling a little proud myself. Here's the start to the old nest egg. Ooh, awesome. As you take on more stories, your base pay will obviously increase, and there are bonuses, of course. Keep up the good work. All right, I'm going to hurry back to HQ and bring word of this story's conclusion to our readers. See you later, partner. I look forward to chasing another big scoop with you. Ah! So long. <laughs> okay, so I get to stay here. <laughs> oh, look at that. There's a shrine. Uh, wait, I, I've been here, haven't I? Let me check the map here. Yeah, this is all places I've been. But I gotta go back to that stable. Um, can I? What? What was here? No. Okay, so I can't warp there. So I'm gonna have to, um, yeah, just walk, I guess. So uh, this way. <laughs> All right. So I guess I'll see you back at the stable. Like I guess I can see the smoke from the stable. So that's where I'm heading. Oh, there's a little Karok up there that needs to reach his friend. All right. Well, let's do that little. Side quests, I guess, first. Where's your friend? If we can, anyway. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, well, this would be a perfect time... Oh, there's already one created here. <laughs> I, was, I was like, this is a perfect time to create a, uh, a, a, a thing for my horse, but... Um, there we go. Alright, in you go. And uh, where's my horse? Oh, just over here? Come on over! So your friend... Oh, okay, we see the green smoke. Okay, this is the first time we use this harness, so I gotta figure out figure this out. So, if I... I think it was under here that I seen it. Uh, yeah, right here. Do I have to mount you first? Hmm. How does this work? Why can't I? Why can I use it? Oh wait, maybe I have to do something at the stable. Maybe I have to equip it that way or something. Let's go. Let's go ask. They should know anyway. <laughs> There's all the goats. That's so cool. Uh, still up after about after sundown, yes. Um, oh, my first time here. Add one point to my pony points. Okay, we need one more. Um, customize horse? Yeah, attach a harness. Oh. There we go. Nope, that's it. Goodbye. Our employee Banji really knows this area, so don't be sure about asking. Okay, yeah, maybe Banji will know about where Elden is. Um, should I? Since everybody's here right now, maybe I should. Ah. Oh. <laughs> nah, there's, there's, there's sleep. Sleep is also training. I'll solve this mystery. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna wait. I'll I'll come back. Let's let's go. Well, if I don't need to come back, then I won't come back. <laughs> let's see. What's the lucky? Oh yeah, what's the news? White goats go amiss. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Other stories. Ah. Blood Moon brings dangerous nights. Yep. We know that. Okay, so there's not much. All right, I'll leave you be. The cold snap is over. Yep. Chork! You saved me from a serious problem. I can't even find words to thank you. From now on, my wonderful white goats eat only the best feed for sure this time. Yes. What are you pondering here? Hmm, is something bothering you, young man? Oh, could it be? The, is this bright young fellow interested in this poster, too? Reports say that this picture 
of a beast that's been rumored to be lurking somewhere in Hyrule. It's been to talks of all the stables. They say that Princess Zelda herself was seen traveling with this beast. Look at those tusks. What a fearsome creature. I wonder where this beast is right now. Quite a mystery, don't you think? <sighs> if I were younger, I'd hike all to all the stables to find out if there's any truth to these rumors. Ooh, neat. Okay, beetles here. Then we got some kids sleeping. Uh, yeah, okay. Anybody else around? Well, we got a well back here. Dogs could go into well. I think that's what I'll do. <laughs> so why not? Let's see, oh, somebody's in here. What? Oh, I. Could have grabbed that, but that's fine. Okay, hello, this well. Water quality fair, moss growth extensive, bright caps present. All right, that's everything I'll jot it down. Oh, what are you doing in a place like this? Although I'm in a place like this. <laughs> hey, you wouldn't happen to be a well enthusiast, would you? Of course. Thought so. My name's Fair. I have a deep love of whales, too. Whales are endlessly fascinating. Their damp environment, their unique systems of life, how they stay cool when it's hot outside. Well, enthusiasts just get it. The appeal of a good well, that is. My dream is to travel around to every single well throughout Hyrule. After scouring all the ancient texts I could find on the subject, I've learned that there are eight, 58 wells. Sadly, I haven't been able to identify their exact locations, but if you have any interest in wells, then maybe you could help me. Would you know? Would you tell me any well locations you know of? I'll reward you, of course. Mm. Ten rupees per location? Yeah. So yeah, I've got a few that I've explored. Thanks, so four of them. All right. Cool. 54 to find. Towns and stables. Or within ruins. Wow. Ah, look out landing. Okay, so they'll be there for when I need to uh, uh, report my findings. But yeah, I see that there's the well extends this way. Ooh. What is this place? It's, oh, it's like, okay, it's like tar or something. I was like, oh, I can just, um, you know, swim, swim through this, but nope. So let's, uh, let's place, oh, no. Let's place this like this. Let's see if we can get across. Should be able to. <laughs> Man, poor, uh, Poor crow rope there. I'm, they're just uh, chilling in the back of. Oh man, chilling in the back. Okay, so this one I'm probably gonna have to attach to the other one. That was my idea here. Um, bring it closer. So yeah, I'll, I'll attach it first from over here. Uh, rotate it. Uh, this, this is probably not gonna work unless I rotate it uh, like this. That's much closer, I think, to what it should be. <laughs> a little off, but that's fine. Come on. Okay. It's holding. Let's go. There's got to be like a, a shrine or something. Huh. There is a... Uh... Oh. Oh. There's like a campfire in here, so what is this? Purple rupee, wow. That's awesome. So okay. 
And then there's a campfire, but no, there's nothing we can updraft. Um, looks like that might be it. Yeah, I don't see anything else here. That's very cool, though. Oh, there's another board over here. That's cool. <laughs> I guess we're we should maybe just bring this board. Uh, bring it closer. Oh, oh no! Don't, don't sink. Put it right here. Perfect. Okay. Very cool. I guess we can climb the ladder to get back out. Just gonna grab some of these before I get out of here. All right. So now we can go help the um, the Korok. <laughs> Try our towing harness. And it's daytime too, so much better. Kenyo, you're you're. Oh yes, that's the yes. Training time. Yeah, good job. Keep it up. Okay, so, um, horse. I need to reach my friend. Sorry for the wait, I had to check out a well. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Do I need to back up a little bit? <laughs> yeah, just, just kick it. Just kick it. All right. All right. Let's attach it like this. Very cool. And let's go. Oh. So cool. Hope you enjoy the ride. I didn't attach you in there, so... <laughs> Oof. It's all good. Try not to hit any rocks. This game, man. It's amazing. Oh, I want to check this sign to see what it says. One second. Due to recent attacks on folks who have distracted by dropped objects, be careful, pay attention to your surroundings, and don't be too careless poking around suspicious objects. What? There's, uh... We can poke around those suspicious objects? Hmm. <laughs> Here you go. There's my friend. Oof. <laughs> Do I really need to take you out of here? Yeah. Alright. Boom. Is that... Yeah? Is that good? Thanks for bringing my friend. Here's something for you. Two seeds. Nice. Bye. Oh. Why, why did that detach? After we were done. It's just rolling on its own. Hey, maybe this person has uh, some ideas. What can I do? Yeah. Hey, you look preoccupied, so I won't keep you long. It's just I saw sunken treasure in a pond on the hill near Ludfoe's Bog. Mm. Seems a shame to leave perfectly good treasure chests down there. I wonder if there's a way to lift them out. Oh, wow. Good tips. Good good stuff. So, yeah. So, I guess um, I'll end the episode here. So, we'll continue uh, searching around. Um, I guess I'll continue going down here and then we'll go check out this area. Um, or we could always check out the look for the treasure. They're not too far away. <laughs> but anyways, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.